Now, the cleanup team arrives. Spider crabs carrying coral in their hind legs, presumably as makeshift body armor. There are rock crabs here, too. They probably detected the carcass almost as soon as the sharks, but they can't move as fast. A month on, and over 30 species of scavenger are clearing away the last edible fragments. But now the scavengers are attracting their own predators. Scabbard fish, habitually swimming upright, are picking them off one by one. Some of the whale's teeth have been dislodged as the skeleton starts to fall apart. Four months later, there is nothing left but a few bones. But even they are food for something. Zombie worms. They tunnel into the bones by injecting acid and so reach the tiny amounts of fat that still remain there. It may take decades, but eventually the last of the bones will crumble and the whole 30-ton carcass will have been recycled. <laughs>